From Channel 3, this is an Eyewitness News Update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Nicole Nalepa, and here are your top headlines on this Wednesday, September 29th. Pfizer is one step closer this morning towards getting its COVID vaccine approved for kids under 12 years old after it sent encouraging data to the FDA yesterday. The company tested a lower dose version of the vaccine on kids between ages 5 and 11 years old, and we're told that their response was just as strong as it was for teenagers who received a standard dose. The shots could be authorized in a few weeks for those between ages 5 and 11. And in the coming weeks, Pfizer is expected to release data on the immune response of vaccines in children 6 months to 5 years old. State lawmakers have voted to extend Governor Lamont's emergency powers for the sixth time. The extension will end on February 15th, which is when lawmakers will be back for their regular session. The governor says the extension will allow him to act quickly when it comes to booster shots and new vaccines for kids. And this morning, police in Enfield are looking for the man who nearly hit their officers in a parking lot. Body and dash cam video capture the scary moment, which police say happened right by the Enfield Mall. They were called to that area for a report of stolen items over the weekend. And when officers confronted the suspect, as you just saw, he sped away. Oof, thankfully, no one was seriously hurt. But investigators say that they are looking for this gray Honda CRV. So call Enfield police if you have any information. Scott? All right, temperatures today will top out in the mid-60s. It's going to be a nice day of weather. We're talking about uh, partly sunny skies to mostly cloudy skies by later on this afternoon. I think with some cool air aloft and some daytime heating, we are going to start to form some clouds. But all in all, a real nice day. Partly sunny. Sunrise was at 646, sets at 635. Now tonight... <laughs> gets a little chilly. Temperatures in the low 40s, mid 40s for inland Connecticut, upper 40s to near 50 for New Haven and Bridgeport. But uh, let me tell you something, those temperatures are cool. That is uh, some good sleeping weather right there. All right, now it gets even cooler. Thursday night into Friday, Friday night into Saturday, 41 degrees. That means some towns in northwest and northeast Connecticut will be dropping into the mid to upper 30s. For Friday night into Saturday morning, that is a chilly time period. All right, so uh, no uh, rotten weather in the in the uh, seven-day forecast, which is good news. Sunday afternoon showers materialize. Have a great day.